My name is Nadine Hoover and I am the Literacy Coach here at Triad Community Elementary. I'm responsible for, for implementing the reading program, uh, modeling for the teachers, uh, coaching. Progress monitoring occurs according to the needs of the students. A benchmark student is a student who is reading at grade level. At benchmark, uh, normally those students are progress monitored monthly. However, on occasion when I am looking at the data, if I see students' data going down, I will ask a teacher to progress monitor more frequently um, to see what is happening and we can look at what the needs of that students are, what we need to change instructionally. A strategic student is a student who is below grade level. Strategic students, they are progress monitored every other week. Uh, and again, looking at the data, I closely follow it and there are times we may have to progress monitor them also more frequently according to the needs. Intensive students are students who are working well below their grade level. A student who is intensive is progress monitored weekly. There are times when I'm watching a particular skills group. Uh, I can watch the data and there are times I see trends in the data that perhaps the classroom teacher does not see and we can meet and go over that data and there are, we just maybe have to add some um, additional instruction in an area to strengthen that area to make the gains that we need to see. Sometimes within a group I'll have a subset of students who they're not making gains. However, it's not time to move them from the group. So what I do is we will differentiate within that group. For example, if we see that there's a fluency issue, we may pull that small group and do some extra instruction with fluency within that skills group for those students. Part of my role is to head a reading team. And with the reading team, we had to devise a way to um, inform parents of what the children are doing within their skills group. So the reading team itself, we came up with a form uh, that gives an indication of where the child is reading and it's, it's a narrative type report um, and checklist type report that it helps uh, the communication between the skills group teacher and the parent. The students for the most part are very motivated uh, for their progress monitoring. They enjoy seeing their data and that's the thing. You need to communicate with the child uh, where their progress is too. When they see they're making progress, um, they're feeling good about it also. I think one of the biggest way the teachers demonstrate to the children the uh, growth they're making is by a, a graph that they see themselves growing on the growth on the, the aim line on the graph. The aim line is the target of where the student started, drawn straight to where the student should be on target. When teachers see the growth the students are making, the impact that they make by following their data and changing their instruction to meet the needs of the students to show the growth uh, is the biggest uh, impact.